So full time, Arsenal 3, Fulham 0. These are my player ratings after our win. So I can learn how to love. Zero, like I'm done. So the Premier League season kicked off today, the first game being Fulham versus Arsenal, and we get off to the best of starts that he really wanted to. We get the we get the three points, beating Fulham by three goals to nil. Goals uh, from Alexander Lacazette, Bamian and Gabriel Maglas getting his debut goal, William getting all three assists. Um and yeah, so these gonna be player ranks for it. So yeah. What's the start to life in the Premier League? Uh, no, no, not life in the Premier League. What am I saying? No, a poor start for life in the Premier League for Fulham as they've come up and we've uh, completely destroyed them. And we did. We did destroy them. I did say it would be 4-0. It, it, it was 3-0, but it could have easily be 5-6 because we were all over them. Uh, so the first, uh, so the first like, five minutes, um, they, they had the chance. Uh, Gabriel was a little bit uh, shaky. Um, but he hasn't played in six months. You have to remember that you know the French league got cancelled, so you wouldn't expect that from him. Overall, he still played a fantastic performance. But yeah, um, he he sort of like left it to Leno, and then they were through on goal. I thought, oh no! But then great save from Leno, and um, yeah, that was pretty much Fulham's only real best chance of the game. They did have another one which Leno saved, but yeah, that was pretty much Fulham's best chance of the game. I'm pretty sure, um, if I remember correctly, but. Um, then after that, like I said, getting on the score sheet, uh, Willian does very well, um, and yeah, like I said, all right, it, it, it was it was a very scra uh, like scrappy goal. Um, also, uh, what was the what's the word? Jammy is like very jammy, but a goal's a goal, and that counts as a goal. That that also counts as us going one 0 up. So yeah, we went we got one 0 up. Then one 0 up half time is decent. Second half comes on corner from Willian, Gabriel, lovely header. 2-0 gets scored on his debut and um yeah I'm so so happy for him very happy for him that he's got he got his goal on his debut um great to see and then after that Abamian again Willian superb what a pass that was from Willian as well over to Abamian one touch uh brings it down keeps going keeps going and then it's a fantastic finish as well um to make it uh 3-0 and then yeah then we have we had some other chances after that as well um which we should have scored um and yeah, that was pretty much it. We win three nil. Um, I just want, uh, b b before I get on my play ratings, I just want to talk about the situation that happened right at the start of the game in in in, in training uh, when there was war when there's not training when the players were like war warming up. It was between Danny Sabas and Eddie Nketiah. If you haven't seen it, they basically had like a massive fight. Uh, well, not really a massive fight. It was just like a little you know little dig at each other. So what happened was is they were doing like the passing, the like little passing drill, what, what we do it for the warm up. So, like, you know, pass to him, and then there's two people in the middle. Um, and Spurs was in the middle, and Eddie Nketa was just, you know, he had the ball. Spurs um, goes in a little bit hard on him, like, completely wipes him with, with, with a tackle. And then Eddie's like, hey, why? Eddie Nketa's like, mate, why are you doing that? Are you, are you trying to take me out or something? And then Spurs, like, pushes him, and then. Um, and then they keep doing it, and then again, Spurs makes a good uh, makes a good challenge, and then Eddie, Eddie and Katie are then it's like, what are you doing? And then yeah, they start pushing each other. Um, if you haven't seen it, uh, it's some BT Sport Instagram page. Go watch it, or just type up Eddie and Katie on Spurs fight, and then it should come up. But um, yeah, that's that's just that that's, that that really like, I don't know what it was. It's like wow, like what what's going on? But um, yeah. Anyway, let's get into the player rating. Starting off in goal, burn then though, eight out of ten, clean sheet. Um, make some saves when he had to, like I said, the save um, the first five minutes. And yeah, brilliant. And uh, it looks like, uh, sadly, guys, Emmy Martin is going to leave. I did put him, I did say Leno will start in my preview. Um, but Emmy, not even, uh, no, Emmy was on the bench, Richard, wasn't he? Um, I mean, was he on the bench? I, I can't remember. Or was it Macy on the bench? Correct me if I'm wrong, I'm not too sure. But yeah, Emmy Martin is no, nowhere to be seen. Leno superb uh, again, um, and now he's got to prove something if he wants to stay in the squad. Um, but yeah, Leno's gonna get an eight for me. Uh, now the back five, right back, heads better in nine out of ten, absolutely amazing. What's the performance? The the amount of brilliant passes he played. He was so direct today, and that's what I love about him. That's what we've been crying out for these past few years with him. It be direct, keep going forward, and that's what that's what he did. Kept going forward, making that brilliant passes. Um, 
And there's one, uh, there's one right at the end where he threw ball into Bamian. Bamian goes on the keeper and sadly missed. But like, wow, what a performance! Not nine outs of Hector Vela in. Now the three in centre backs: Kieran Tierney, eight out of ten. Done what he has to do. And another super performance for me as well. Um, keeps keeps doing what he has to do. And yeah, no problems with him at all. Eight out of ten. Um, then we have Gabriel. Gabriel, uh, ten out of ten man in the match. He uh, there's a stat that he actually got 102 touches, most touches in the game. So um, yeah, the most touches in the game, and that's just superb. That's why I've given him man of the match. Got his game debut goal as well, and uh, yeah, great debut, dream debut. Um, and then we have alongside him Rob Holding, eight out of ten. Simmons Tierney done what he has to do. Um, made some good headers away, good interceptions. Uh, is he going to be leaving to Newcastle? I'm not too sure. But at the moment he's staying and he, he's playing, so yeah, he's playing well, so he's going to go in there. And then left back, Ainsley met the Niles. Um, I'm going to give him an eight, uh, nine or eight, uh, eight. I'm going to give him an eight as well. I thought he was superb once again. Um, yeah, another fantastic performance from him. And then midfielders, El Nenny, uh, eight out of ten, absolutely amazing again. Like the amount of times he got hold of the ball, started playing it forward. You know, I call him Mohamed all sideways, but he was actually trying to play it forward this time. Um, so I'm gonna give him an eight. Shaka eight out as well, uh, eight 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 out of ten as well. Again, super performance from Granite Xhaka. Keeps on doing what he's doing, and it's great to see. Um, you know that he's actually getting down and playing for us now. Um, because there's games last season, Emery. He just wasn't doing it. He obviously threw the captain's armband. Like no one would have thought that he he would come back from that. Not everyone thought he's done. He's over. I need to come back. So that's good from him. And then on the right hand side, who was on the right hand side again? Oh, of course, Willian. Willian. Nine out of not. I don't usually do halves, but nine point five out of ten. He he got three assists. It was between him and Gabriel from a man of the match. Um and yeah, Willian. What's a debut for him as well, and I I can see why Mick Arteta has signed him because he gives us that something he gives us like that you know he he can easily get the assists he got three assists today yeah um so yeah William's gonna go on the right uh William's gonna get a nine out of ten uh, Lacazette's gonna get a nine out of ten well got his goal and and you know uh, this is why this is why I said I'll put him in there over Eddie Nketiah because he knows how to hold hold up the ball very well and he was doing that for the the whole game the holding up making some good passes got his goal so yeah nine out of ten for Lacar Abamia nine out of ten as well you know does what he always does scores goals and um, that's another goal he scored and once again racing for that top uh, uh, golden boot and um, I'm sure. He's going to be close to getting it or maybe even get it this season. Uh, some of the troops, uh, Danny Subas, I'm going to give actually all the sub six because there wasn't that long. Um, but yeah, subs were Eddie, Subas, and Pepe. Um, and Mick Arnsetter, 9 out of 10. Uh, got our first win, three points. And yeah, I thought the lineup was strong. And yeah, we ended up, Saxons were very good. So we ended up getting the win as well. So yeah, there we have it. Let's let my player ratings. Arsenal beating Fulham by three goals to nil. Fantastic start for the Gunners. And we move on to West Ham um, on, on, I think, Saturday or Sunday. I can't remember, really remember. But, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy watching the next one. Peace. Come on, you Gunners.